people can have small interpretations of things and not realize it. Like, uh, my sister recently watched Titanic, and she says it's a sad movie. And it's just sad. It makes her sad. The movie's sad. It's sad. It's just what she says. And, uh, I mean, that's an example of a small interpretation. Or also when I made Mode of Dust. People said it made them sad. It made them feel insignificant. Small. It made them feel small. But the point of Titanic and Mode of Dust were not to make you feel small and sad. Because Titanic was not about sadness and despair and loss of hope it was about finding love and how it transcends death and everything else and mode of dust was i mean when i made it or carl sagan wrote it or whatever it was about how easy it would be to have a peaceful world if people only understood it. That's what I think it's about. Because think of the rivers of blood spilled by all those generals over a tiny fraction of a piece of the dot. You know, when you think you're the biggest thing in the world when you're not, that's when bad things happen. That's, um, that was a major part of you know, what Mode of Dust was about. And it wasn't to make you feel insignificant or small. Or maybe it, maybe it was, but to only go that far is a small interpretation. Just like the movie Titanic being a sad movie is small interpretation.